outfit. Put in a slip dress underneath and then a cardigan. I mean a cardigan, a sweater, I mean. Uh, and then this cute bag that my mom made. We had a phase where we were making so many handbags and this is one of them. Here is the bag collection from basically all the bags that my mom and me during our short phase of bag making. We were hooked on making these bags. They were really easy to make, but we made so many. Don't mind the mess. I'm still trying to look for a place to put these. Um, but the addiction got so crazy that we just kept making so many. So, and then they didn't have many yarns left at the store and it's only these type of colors. So we just kept making the same, same color bags, <laughs> but they're all different shapes and sizes. Um, but this is, one, this is actually one of my favorite, uh, ones. Cause you see, it's a, a lot tighter in the, in the knots versus these. Another day, another car ride back in New York didn't sit in the car as often as I do now. I'm always in the car driving back and forth. I'm not currently driving, but um, just in general. Uh, Cause in New York, I work in the city. So it's always the trains and it was just so convenient um, besides the delays, which always suck. But besides that, just always on the train, I could take a nap. Whereas here, if I'm driving you know, to work, a supermarket, I can't nap. Also, side note, very random, but I have noticed since moving here that everyone likes sitting in their car. Is that a California thing? Because uh, at least in New York, that's not something I often see. But here, regardless in the supermarket or at the mall, just a bunch of people are always in their car sitting. I guess there's nowhere to sit outside. Well, yeah, actually speaking of which, there's not a lot of benches around here. Random thought of the day. Um, and the car that I had in New York, I basically just had it sitting in parking for a whole year. I didn't move it unless I needed to, but I never drove it as often as I do now. Favorite store of the locals, Costco. It, there's always so many people here and the lines are always crazy and looking for parking is always a hassle. Uh, today's a weekend, so even more people I just think this is just a, you know, weekend, like, it spot. Just everyone coming here, getting them groceries, good deals. This is the place to be. And also cheap gas. Everyone always comes here buying in bulk and their carts are always so full with items. But for us, whenever we get stuff from Costco, we only have like one or two items. The hunt for a parking spot continues. We are still looking for a spot as we go in circles around the parking lot. Found this at the Costco. Might get this for Lunar New Year. I have it in one. They rearrange everything here. No, no, they, look, there's flowers now just sitting in the front. No, they changed up everything. Look, the tables are all full. Yeah, hey y'all, what is it exact? What is it? Oh, I want that shrimp cocktail. So sometimes we use this to make ceviche and also shrimp noodles. Well as uh, summer rolls, Vietnamese summer rolls. Trying to sample. It's good. I love soups, like I said. You got to get the chicken basket. You got all we can get. Look, no, 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 Lobster tail. I love lobsters. I love seafood. If I could give up meat and just have seafood all the time, I would do that. Like I said, there's not much in our cart. Now we're, now just four items in the cart. Whereas folks have like 
cart full of stuff. Oh my god, I love it again. I wasn't able to go to the farmer's market today like I wanted to. Woke up late, as usual. And my favorite baguette spot is sold at the farmer's market. I mean, it is soft. It looks, it's fresh. But I don't know. I still like my, um, I still like the baguette from the other location. They still have holiday uh, items still here. Ooh, pineapple shrimp. Okay. We have a lot of Asian items here. Yesterday we had it. This is childhood. I used to eat this all the time when I was a kid. Boba mochi. I love boba. Super surprised they have this here as well. The ultimate Lunar New Year dish. We sold out by Chinese New Year. Yeah, it's already like not a lot already. So people put it in fridge. Don't have a fridge up Yeah, because you can freeze it. Three weeks. Two more weeks. It's only two weeks. Yeah. Put it in the freezer two weeks ago. No. Not as fresh. But everything is fresh. Why do you start all seafood? Nothing else. I love seafood. Oh, Chinese New Year decoration. Yeah, you can decorate. Oh, yeah, eggs. I ran out of eggs. Hey, don't tell me they don't have big boxes. Right? Big boxes, eggs. Brown, they are going to stack. No wonder they are going to stack. That means the amount of people going in to get dairy. Yeah, that's crazy. Little by little, more items. This is mom's favorite. Grapefruits daily. And then she tosses it back in because she's looking My for the best one. My grapefruit. If she could she's swap out loose. and select it, but each she, she grapefruit it, she it, but she's not by herself, she would. Just one by one, just like the Asian supermarkets. But yeah, apparently if you eat a grapefruit a day, is that what they said? A day? No, good for me. What loss is it daily? Oh, it, yeah, help. No, I know, but what is the benefits of it? Oh, for weight loss. No. No? Then why are you eating it? She told me just Google. She doesn't remember why it's beneficial, but she's eating grapefruit daily because it's healthy. Like buy now. Oh, that's a lot of. I don't think it's gonna last for three weeks. I don't think it'll last. It'll be moldy. Oh, that's that's better. Mm. It's healthy. Mm. Mm. Swallow nest collagen. You get it. This is the mechanic. But this one actually says collagen. And this is new. Never tried this one. Oh, there's actually a few packaging on this one. There's only four. That one at least has eight. I tried this one before. I liked it. things we bought
I know that drinks um, compared to now I only started drinking it a year or the year before um, because I was studying for a certification oh there's someone randomly staring at me from behind and he I think he's smiling <laughs> anyways things you get while living here anyway so then I was um, I started drinking that for my certification and then I kind of got hooked and now every well now at work I drink it every day uh, I drink coffee every morning um, I make myself also iced coffees. I always, always almond milk. I'm a big fan of almond milk because I cannot drink whole milk or any, any actually dairy in general. Um, even though I love cheese, but I try not to, I try to stay away from cheese. Um, most of the time because I notice that I break out a lot, especially on my forehead. If I, I eat a lot of cheese, there's something, there's like a aftertaste, but, but I can't tell, keep going straight, but I'm not entirely sure what it is that lingers in the back of my throat. It's like lavender. I think it's lavender. Go straight. Then it's on the left. Cheers! Special noodle soup. Another frequent spot of ours. So their noodles are really good. Uh, Mom's favorite is the Hainanese chicken rice. Because she's Hainanese, so she loves chicken rice. Getting the beef combo. They have beef tongue. You usually get the dish, the rice dish. This is it. This is what you usually get home. Beef rolls up. 
Oh, that one is a shrimp ball. We have the wood here. And cucumber salad. Oh, you were so to, you were gonna make the cucumber salad. Wait, mine has cucumbers. No, I said you previously. I have cucumbers. Or this one. I'm not that hungry because I just chugged the coffee, but I am drinking my beef noodle. Okay. Splinters from these like wooden chopsticks. Behind the scenes. That is the chicken rice. And then this is the beef noodle. So this is the thin rice noodle. Beef tripe. Beef balls. Corn. This is is this spinach? Spinach. Oh, 